Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being with me. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Okay, so Aquarius, this is the second time I'm recording the video, so, so I don't know. Let's get into it. Uh, thank you, Lord God, for blessing the Aquarius with a clear and concise message from you. All right, so Aquarius, pretty straightforward reading. We do have some little bumps and curves that will go around, but I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Um, Aquarius, I'm going to say you were, some of you still are, but um, some of you were dealing with um, a karmic partner who um, this relationship had a, an expiration date. It had an end date. This relationship came to you so that you could learn about yourself, learn about what you want, what you don't want, um, what you don't want in a partner, learn about you and how you deal with other people, um, maybe how you have like some self-sacrificing ways. And that's why the cards are asking you to be true to you, um, do for you, put you first. Um, because maybe you were really true to this person, this relationship, and you it wasn't reciprocated. You were loyal, you were dedicated, uh, you were there for this person, and it just was never reciprocated because this person, they're not on your level, not energetically, not spiritually, none of that. This person may not even have a spiritual bone in their body, okay? Um, you could be dealing with someone like that. You could be dealing with someone who it's really just giving over to the world, the carnal ways, materialistic, egotistical, maybe even borderline evil. I don't know. You know who you're dealing with. Um, that's for some of you. That's a story for some of you. Some of you, you are or you were the other woman. And you met this person while they were in a relationship. And you guys met for a reason, so you can learn a lesson um, in, in hopes that you both would grow, would ascend, would spiritually grow. Um, maybe it was that this person should have chosen you. They didn't choose you. They stay, They chose to stay in this connection, in this uh, karmic or toxic connection, and, and try to keep you in a place of, you know, the other woman or the other man. But it looks like either you, Aquarius, or your person, but it looks, I, I really feel like it's you. You've walked away, okay? You've walked away from the connection, from whatever connection you're in, whether you were the other woman or you were the person that was in a relationship with this this individual. Uh, you've walked away. And you, you walked away because this person, not only were they not reciprocating your energy, but they were, they were a thief. They were a liar. They were swindling you. They were lying to you. Um, they were um, they were saying whatever it is they thought they needed to say to you so that you would stay. Um, they just were not honest. They didn't have your best intentions, or you know, at heart, or they had no intentions for you. Actually, um, they also could have been cheating. They also could have had a karmic person or the outside of you guys' relationship that they would travel to sometimes and have relations with um, that maybe even they worked with this person, okay? Um, this person, the other person, this karmic person could have known about you and she could have tried to throw a monkey wrench into your relationship with your person. Because the cards are asking you to protect yourself, burn your candles, and wear your crystals. Also, you want to do that because you leaving this person has brought them a lot of despair, a lot of change. The three and the two makes a five, so a lot has shifted within their reality. They could be low on funds, they could just be feeling low, they could be feeling sick, they could just, they're not in a good place, they're not in a good space. Because for some of you, you are the only good thing in their life. You are, or you were, your saving grace. Um, you brought a lot of light, and joy, brightness, abundance, uh, her sophistication, positivity, 
to their life and um, you taking that away um, it's going to make this person very angry okay because they're going through that change through that shift and uh, the cards want you to do this protect yourself burn your candles and wear your crystals because this person feels like you know if you find someone new I will pursue you just to sabotage the connection so this person has it out for you now because you you've decided to walk away and in your travel away from this person you're going to find union Aquarius you're going to find marriage a serious connection um, maybe even a life partner I don't think it's going to be immediately and I don't think you want it to be immediately because you need to do some healing work here um, yeah you need to do some healing work uh, so with this pathway card coming out it says that you're on a new pathway you're traveling away from and this card specifically talks about one year one to two years so it could be one to two years before you're married and you know settled in another relationship you just need that much time to heal to go through that process to even learn more about yourself for some of you For some of you, you need to do a lot of work on you. Um, and also for some of you, you've really just kind of thrown yourself into work and or your hobbies. And if you don't have a hobby, it says get one. And if you have a hobby, it says learn your hobby, practice it, perfect your hobby. And you, because you could possibly monetize it. You could possibly get paid for what it is you love to do. The cards want you to know, Aquarius, that um, you are moving on to a steady and reliable path. That word path, coming up again. This person knows that you're on to better and you're on to um, what's meant for you. So this person is, it seems as if they're going to try to come back around and taunt you. You know, say things like you think you're so mature, but you aren't. Um, they could even go as far as to send you messages, um, maybe little sexual into, yeah, sexual messages um, about how they dream about sex with you. Um, you could even be dreaming about sex with them. It's a part of the grieving process, people. Don't beat yourself up. Just go through it. Work through the emotions, but don't go backwards. Work through the emotions, not go back to work through so if you if you feel like you missed that person one day miss them but work through it you know still that's why they want you to get a hobby some of you you don't do anything you go to work you come home you watch tv you gossip you whatever you need a hobby you need a positive outlet because you're going to have to go through the grieving process this person also could even go as far as to be manipulative and um, they'll say anything to get you to retract to come back like um, I want to ask you to move in with me when I first pulled this card coupled with all these other cards I immediately got that this person could ask you to move in with them and for some reason Aquarius you actually say yes this person would stall the move-in date. There would be so many complications. There would be so many excuses. All in all, this person really doesn't want you to move in with them. They just want to for you to retract your, you know, come back. They want you to bring your energy back. Okay? They want your goodness. This person knows that they're not good for you because um, they're saying you should probably run away from me. Also, Aquarius, I got that you could be saying this because you have nothing nice, nothing good to say to them. So you, your energy could be like, look, you should just probably run away from me because nothing good is going to come out of a conversation between you and I. Aquarius, this relationship could have had a lot of chemistry, uh, compatibility, and it, it brought in the beginning, there's a lot of promise. But the cards want you to know that sometimes the hottest love has the coldest ending. 
um, some of you had to walk away. Just really, really walk away. A cold turkey. A coldest ending. Cold turkey. Like you just had to go cold turkey on this person. No gradual will we text here and there. We see each other only on a Monday. No, no, no. Some of you just cold turkey. Bam. It's done. Because um, you know that better is out there for you. Um, and this person also knows that better is out there for you. In the extended reading, I want to go into this union. This union that is coming for you. Also, I want to go into this other woman. Because she could be doing some, some work. Some spell work on you. She knows about you. She knows about the love that your person has for you. Even if they never expressed it to you, your person never expressed that love, this person knows that they love you, they like you, they want you, they desire you more than they desire this person. So if your person is married, the wife knows that her husband desires you. And if you have, you know, you just walked away from your boyfriend or lover and he has another person on the side, this other person knows that he or she desires to be with you. And this person could be doing some energy work. So we're gonna see what this person is up to and what is their motive here, especially with you walking away. I mean, you're a non-factor now. She should just be happy. But they won't because it is karmic. Um, your person also could be getting their karma for doing you wrong. Their karma could also be that forever they'll be in this energy of despair um, they let something really good go. They let it slip through their fingers. They just couldn't show up their best self. Um, they knew that this uh, relationship was significant. The both of you did. And I think you showed up to the highest vibration that you could ascend to. And this person just showed up. Just showed up. You know? Um... So Aquarius, in the extended, we're going to go into this union. We're going to go into this person doing this energy work. She could also be independent from this relationship too. This could just be a woman who just doesn't like you, who has an out for you. Um, and she could just be waiting in the winds, waiting for things to fall apart for you. Okay? Um, she could also be someone at your job um, waiting for things to fail for you. All right, so Aquarius, if you want to get the extended reading, the link is below. You can get your own personal oracle reading just like this one. Excuse me, just like this one at the website level. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Me a Coffee link. And um, if you have a question or two, you can text your question to the number below. Um, is this person going to come back? What do they want from me? Why are they bothering me? What should I be concerned with? Um, thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.